Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another beatbox tutorial by me. Today I'm gonna show you how to do the blade snare. I used to snare in Insane, I used to snare in Rampage. I'm going. Insane. Lots of people don't know how to do it. That's why you're in the right spot to learn it right now in this video. To do the blade snare, you need to be able to do two sounds. Sound number one is the inward K snare. There's a lot of tutorials on the tutorials. There's a lot of videos teaching the inward snare in the middle, on the side. You need to learn it on the side for this one. And by the way, if you can do the inward K snare on the side already, skip this part. I learned the inward K snare like this. I was putting out my tongue like this. Or like that. Depends on what side you want to do it. And then I was imagining to say a K, but inwards. So instead of K, 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 you do K, 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 K. And now pull out the tongue while you do it. At the beginning, it might sound like this. And that's fine. If you can't find the right spot to do the inward K snare, try to imagine you want to imitate the wind but inwards. As soon as you have found this very spot in your mouth, then try to reintroduce the K. This might will take a few weeks to really master it, but it's worth it because every beatboxer is using the sound, or at least the majority. All right, so step number two, we're gonna introduce the voice inside. I really like voices and snares. I don't know why, but it always makes it sound more interesting. A lot of people think when I do the blade snare, I do the voice inwards, but it's actually outwards. It sounds strange because the inward snare is actually inwards, but I don't really breathe in when I do the inward snare. So let's do this exercise first. Close your mouth and nose and try to imitate this sound. Kinda sounds like a dog, right? As soon as you have the sound, try to do the same without closing your mouth and your nose. All right, now we have this really strange dog sound and we have the inward case in there on the side and we try to combine it now. When I stretch the sound, there's kind of a natural double voice coming up, but you don't really need to stretch it, so therefore you don't need this double voice. So if you do it really short and tight, it will gonna sound like this. And this is how it sounds on the beat. And by the way, you can use this weird dog sound also for a kick. What I do here is I do an inward kick, kind of like a lip roll. And then I combine it with this dog sound and it's still outward. And some people think it's two sounds, but it's actually me closing my mouth at the beginning and then open my mouth. And that's why it sounds like two sounds, but it's actually just one sound. All right, guys, that's it with the blade snare tutorial. I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you have some questions to the blade snare or you want to learn another sound, just type in the comments. As I'm working really hard right now to build up my YouTube channel, it would be really helpful to give a like to the video, subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. I see you guys for the next video.